Hello everybody, it's me, Lindsay Rogers, or Lindsay Star. Welcome back to the Wrestling Fan Vlog. I was supposed to upload a video on Thursday. Instead, it kind of backfired, so I do apologize for that. Anyway, they, this video is going to be really going to sound to me an ugly rant. And something that I'm going to maybe say something stupid. And I don't care how much this is going to hit hurt me. But I know this is going to hurt everybody else. Or something like that. But pretty sure this is going to hurt me. I don't like to talk about this. But it brought to my attention that WWE has... Uh, they do some ridiculous things. And the one thing that I said about what happened with WWE Raw was a little bit crazy. So my... I decided to go over to the WWE Superstars page. And one person I ended up looking in particular, or, which I do not want to, but it forced me to go through this. But, I mean, seriously, I do not like talking about him. But... Anyway, anyway, it was a video, you know, on this super, certain superstars page, and the reason why I don't like talking about this is well, cause I do not follow him anymore. Not since, not since I found out he's. Still in a relationship. Unless I'm wrong. <laughs> anyway, the wrestler I'm referring to on the, actually, the WWE NXT UK roster, Cash is oh no. Or two, mostly the whole entire independent scene in and to Tim Donst, Chris Hero. And, uh, yeah. What's making me feel angry about this? Well, apparently there was an interview took place. And it says here, exclusive. Cash is oh no on why he's still the best British wrestler. Really? Let's say I check and I know this. He's not even British. He's more American. And... And the reason why I'm freaking out this is because, first of all, he's on the NXT UK roster. That's number one. And even though he should be on the NXT roster, which is, I don't know why. Which is probably something to have to do with, uh... Probably didn't have anything for him. Again. <laughs> anyway. So... What so, but to say that he's a British wrestler, no, he's an American wrestler on a British r r roster that is NXT UK. He's not legitimately a UK wrestler because he was not born in the UK, he was not trained in the UK. I know because he was back, he was born in Dayton, Ohio. You know. The United States of America. Alright. Uh, and to say that he's a British wrestler? No. Unless he unless I unless he went unless he decided to go a la David Starr and decides to give up his um give up and become an uh, like an expat then I wouldn't. Then I would know. But as far as I can say, I don't think so. Oh, I mean, truth be told, why lie saying that he's a British wrestler when the fact is he's not from the UK? Hey, and plus, let's face it. I mean, he has been trained by a lot of wrestlers. 
he's been trained by a couple of wrestlers. One of them is um, oi, I can't believe I'm going. To, I'm going to say this. One of them is WWE Hall of Famer. Uh, oh boy. Dory Funk Jr. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> Head in the tip of my tongue. But let's not forget, he trained wrestlers as well. Namely, Tim Dons, Cesaro, uh, even referee Drake Wirtz. And also, all elite wrestling referee uh, Bryce Rensberg. Although, unless he didn't, then it's probably Mike Quackenbush, I'm thinking. Yikes. So, anyway, so, oh, it's just, it feels like this is, this thing is just, like, misleading. When the fact is, even though he hasn't been seen on, on I don't know, on anywhere, let alone, I mean, he hasn't been seen on NXT since January 16th, 2020, and, you know, You know, why? Anyway. Anyway, even though I don't like talking about him any much more, but, I mean, all I can still think about is his matches against Tim Dance, where Dance kicked his butt twice. I see. Both happened at all. Sorry, I'm about to say absolute intense wrestling thing, and which I can link it all down. So, anyway, let me know now in the comments what you guys think. Is is Cassius Ono really a British wrestler, or is he more of an American wrestler? Because, as I can tell you. Him being wrestling for over, what, 20 years? He's more... He's more American. Because he's been wrestling mostly throughout the independent scene. And then, of course, being on NXT. And besides, there's one thing, if I would say something real stupid about this, is I rather... I, I'd rather kiss a certain British YouTuber who has... Three point. How many subscribers does he have? I'm gonna get in trouble for this. <laughs> I don't care. Especially his fans are like. Some of his fans are like really crazy. But what I'm trying to say is. Which I could try to access it. Wait. Volume down. Volume down. Wait. I... I... want to get myself in trouble, but... I will say this. If I... If I, I will say this right. I rather kiss this... You, the certain British YouTuber who has, as of right now, 3.44 million subscribers, which is secondary channel that he hasn't been posted up in a while, I do say that, is at 1.57 million subscribers. Yes. I'd rather kiss him in front of Cassius Ono in order to, you know, I don't know, you, you guys get what I'm trying to say? Anyway, thank you for watching. If you guys like to see more of my videos, uh, like to see me more talking about pro wrestling, let me know down in the comments and also make sure to hit that like button. And also make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel. I will promise you guys again, I will have more videos coming soon. Okay, until then. Bye.